What is going on guys? It's your boy Scoop Coda and today I'm with my girlfriend Racy and well my two best friends are right not in the picture but they are actually clear over there because today we are doing a couple shelters to see who can build the best shelter if they were in a survival situation. Now they have their spot picked out and we have our spot picked out. I know it does not look like much. the ground underneath us I didn't know it was videoing. yeah <laughs> and uh so right now my plan is you can see the log where racy is standing we're gonna put a log across and then on this side a log going down and then keep going on this side logs at an angle and on the top logs keep going across and then we're gonna shelter close half of one end and enclose the other end and then we'll make a door and then Voila, that would be our shelter. So let's do it. Okay, so if you guys can see, I know it ain't much, but that's a start. And to me, honest with you, it's gonna turn out pretty dang good. What you saying, babe? What? Do you think it's gonna be turn out pretty dang good when we're done? I hope so. Me too. All right, we're still going. All right, we're gonna continue on. I'm gonna continue building and uh, let's check to see how Richard and Bree are doing. What's up, guys? Um, just here doing the survival shelter challenge. And, uh, well, you see this tree that sort of came behind us? Yeah, well, we're gonna use that as our main support and lay branches up against on the sides. Try to create a, a nice little shelter. Too many supplies, all I got is a pocket knife. So let's see how this works. So he started to build and putting the tree limbs up. Uh, we're keeping most of the big ones that are sticking off of the branches, but we're cutting off the smaller ones so that way it's not as pokey. I'm gonna cut away some of the little grass, dead grass particles with uh, apparently all of Richard's pocket change and this pocket knife. So I'm going to show the progress that we have so far. 
this is this side. All things to return. Uh, it's been on the inside mostly. So, and I chopped down some of the inside grass and stuff. And I've started to put some rocks down as like a type of like flooring, I guess. Richard's getting his gains in for the day. So Richard is still building, as you can see. Um, I've decided that I'm going to start getting some rocks that are out here. I've decided I'm going to go get those and then put them on the bottom. Uh, so that way it'll be a little more comfortable sitting area. So that way it's more like a shelter. I okay, so Richard just informed me that he is planning on completely redesigning it. So he can have fun with that. I'm going to continue on my flooring technique. So I guess I'm going to be peeling the bark instead of the flooring. Richard tried to kill himself. <laughs> What's the point of having it go all the way up there, though? Oh, well, I don't need a ledge. Why? Why do we have it? Because I need this big of a piece. see Richard's putting um, a bunch of tree bark um, on the side of it to hopefully help with like wind and like more like the elements. In this type of situation building a fort just out of this kind of stuff. Okay so here's an update. Here's what it looks from this side. Which which side is this? Huh? Like I don't know my directions. This is south side. The south? This is the north side. The north side? It's looking like this. And then here's the, how it looks from the south side. I think it's looking pretty good. Richard's doing most of the work, so... Yeah. So that's why it looks so good, because he's doing most of the work. Um, I just don't know what to do. I don't know how to help. It's kind of in the zone. I don't want to like mess it up. This is our final product. I think it turned out great. There's no wind in here. Like literally none at all. It's great. Just chilling. In a shelter.
There's no wind at all. I don't know if you can hear, but no wind. <laughs> I'm a genius. I honestly can't wait to see how long it takes them to finish theirs. It took us, what, like 30 minutes? I have no idea. But they're uh -huh. just going to come in second. Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> they can buy us ice cream. Heck yeah, I like ice cream. <laughs> we are going to be going to the vehicle now because we're finished. They aren't. Um, we're gonna take a power nap, see if they're finished by the time we wake up. We're gonna play nap roulette, fall asleep and not set an alarm and see when we wake up. It's my favorite game to play. Okay, we added a lot to it so far. I know it doesn't look like much, but it's getting there. And I'm excited because we, we are gonna win this. All right, let's continue on. Okay, so we're pretty much done building it. The next part is we gotta cover all the little holes. Now, there's a bunch of this grass around us collect enough of it and set it on our shelter it'll protect us in the, from the weather keep us warm so that's what we're gonna start doing yeah let's do it All right, guys, I do believe the shelter is done. Check it out. Okay, so Babe, do you think we won? I hope so. Pretty sure we did. But then again, I, we don't know what Breeze and Richard's shelter look like. There are a few things I need to do to our shelter to hopefully give us a chance to win. But as of right now, it's pretty much done. So I'm going to do a little more to it, and then we'll get back to you guys. All right, guys. So our shelter is finally done. Doesn't look like much, but get this angle let's see it actually looks like something so let's go ahead and get in there okay so in all reality like if we were in an actual survival situation this would work because the top would keep us dry and wind free same with the back and the sides yeah as long as the middle doesn't really help but it would work for one night if you were in a survival situation so we are done with our shelter uh, we don't know if Bree and Richard are done yet but we'll just wait it out so we'll get back to you guys when Richard and Bree are done all right so we're, oh, uh. <laughs> so there's Richard and Bree I guess they're done with their fort as we are done with ours so let's go take a look at what they got <laughs> We 
We have the outside chill spot. Oh, that's not too shabbly. That is not too shabbly. Sunglasses go. Babe, they didn't do a half bad job. Go check out the back. There's no wind from right here. None. I don't know. It's going to come pretty close. They did actually really well. <laughs> These guys actually did really freaking good. Good job, guys. And it's enough. It's big enough to where we could lay down and sleep in the sleeping bag if we wanted to. Not bad, guys. Not bad. All right, guys. Well, we're seeing their fort or shelter, and now it's time to go show them ours. So let's go. Let's take them our fort or shelter. <laughs> Other than that log in the middle, but <laughs> there's a sp there's space. You could lay down. Yeah, that's yeah. terrifying looking. Uh, <laughs> you look inside. I could sit up in it though. Go ahead, Bree. Richard, get your butt in there. Ah, uh, that thing's dirty. That. Oh, get in there. <laughs> Dude, this is about you know, the same size as the tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. I could sit up straight in the tunnel. I'll just let Richard get in there. You need a rake. He used his hands. I used my hands. But it's enough to where we could sleep. It's like it would keep us, if it rained a little bit, it would keep us kind of dry. And it keeps the wind bamboo? out. No, it's cattails. I got a lot of cattails. Pretty gnarly, right? <laughs> okay, guys. So we've seen our shelter, and you guys seen Richard and Bree's shelter. So now you guys have to pick who is the winner of this challenge. Is it me? Or me and Racy? Or Richard and Bree. <laughs> yeah, Pick us. <laughs> you like ours better. More room. Yeah, but ours is more protected. Yeah. Yeah. But you act, yeah. like the, you act like it rains in Kansas. Uh, you Kansas? act like we don't have the state, like all the seasons in one day. This no. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. If you guys like this video, make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for me. And with that being said, woo. <laughs> I'll see you guys on the next adventure. Scoop Coda out. Peace.